amateurist has said he thought hell had opened after his car hit a gaping four-foot-deep pothole in a residential street. Grant Parker was so stunned by the pothole that he decided to climb inside after the road had fallen in due to the weight of his wheel. The 46-year-old had been driving down a road in York when the concrete collapsed and the front portion of his Volvo C30 disappeared into the void. Pictures taken by a resident on Granville Terrace in York show the motorist inside the hole with his head and shoulders popping out of the top. A City of York Council spokesman said the hole was the result of a sewer collapse, which occurs when escaped water washes away the structure of a road until it gives way. Workers from Yorkshire Water, which is responsible for York's sewage system, have filled the hole in since it appeared on March 25. Grant, who works as a landlord, said he couldn't believe his eyes when he saw the hole. I was driving down the street, and all of a sudden the car just sank down and went into a hole. It did some damage to the car, and I'm still waiting for the insurance to deal with it. There was just a little mark in the road, and as I went over it, the whole car dropped at one side. I got out and thought it was unbelievable. Why oh you could see a tunnel under the road. I thought hell had opened up or something. He added, I actually got in the hole, it went right down, and you could see right under the road. The hole has been filled in, but only recently. It was cordoned off for a while because they couldn't move any cars because the road was unsafe. Grant was able to reverse out and take the car to a garage for repairs. And it said he has already spent £200 having work done to repair the vehicle, and it yet to hear whether his insurance will cover the cost. A spokeswoman for City of York Council said the authorities' highways identified the hole as a sewer collapse. SHE said this is caused by water escaping from somewhere and washing out the structure of the road over time until a void is created. The road surface will hold up for so long and then the void becomes too large and the tarmac fails. She confirmed the road had been repaired, adding that liability will not be with City of York Council. The spokeswoman said an insurance claim had been received, but that it would be redirected to officials at Yorkshire Water. A Yorkshire Water spokesman said, We carried out sewer repair work on Granville Terrace on April 5 and completed it on April 12. We are sorry to hear Mr. Parker damaged his vehicle whilst the road service was damaged, and we repaired the road as quickly as possible once we were notified of the issue on April 3. In circumstances like this, it is the insurance companies who resolve any claims 